Greetings, friends. Today I'm going to explain some of the basics about NBA Infinite. And so, NBA Infinite is a mobile only basketball game, and it's pretty similar to that of NBA 2K Mobile and NBA Live Mobile. So, if you have played NBA Live Mobile or NBA 2K Mobile, then you'll see some similarities here as you go and collect cards to add to your collection, add players slash cards to add to your to your team. And so you could do this by just completing games and uh, completing tasks and things like that. And then you can go and unlock some some new cards uh, to go and add to your collection. And so that is you know, one major similarity there compared to the other, you know, NBA games that are out there. So and so once you have your team assembled and everything, you go and go into a game and then there's different ways you can go play. There's stuff that you have to unlock. Um, by leveling up so like dynasty ranked you need to be level six three versus three ranked level four things like that and so um you can you know the, the games are basically one versus one and three versus three in this case here one versus one is locked you need to be level seven for that but you know you know for the 11 point game that is three versus three and so that's how most of these games go they're like either three versus three or 1v1 and you're playing in a like street ball kind of setting so it's going to kind of feel similar to the park in a way like a 2k a little bit you know give you some mini park vibes in a way but you know but um that's that's how it goes though so you get your cards and then when you go and play in in these park games then you're playing with with and against other players from around the world so so you choose one player from your team um, as your player to use when when going out there and playing uh, with the other players from around the world so but that that is how that works one thing that i really appreciate about nba infinite is that they actually have a practice mode um, which is something that nba 2k mobile and nba live mobile unfortunately don't have and so it's really nice to have this because you can go and just shoot around get yourself comfortable with the game get yourself get you know get a feel for things and stuff like that and so that's where we're gonna go right now. We're gonna go into shoot around. One thing I wanted to mention is that you see that blue light in front of your player. Well, if a defender comes into that blue circle, it's gonna turn red, which means that if you shoot the ball, then it'll likely mean that you're gonna miss that shot. So when you're going for shots, make sure you are sh shooting the ball um, when this indicator, when this blue light in front of your character remains blue. Because if it's red, then you're probably going to miss because you're, you're getting um, the defense is doing a good job on you, uh, good, doing a good job staying in front of you and guarding you and whatnot. So this is pretty similar to three on three freestyle basketball because three on three freestyle basketball, they kind of have the same kind of it's kind of the same type of thing where it's got like the blue like cone or light, whatever you want to call it in front of the character. And then, yeah, when a defender comes in front then then that's a more than likely a miss occasionally there's a you know a lucky shot but other than that it's all it's an automatic a miss so, so so make sure to take a smart shot so when you're playing games make sure you're out there taking smart shots it would do it, it would that'd be great all right folks it's time for us to get into a game now so here we go. So like I said, it's three on three, street ball. Choose whichever NBA players on your team. Players, and the score goes to tip 11. Tip off. The offense is moving up the court. Stay for your man. See, see how the, the, First score the light the in front of the character goes, in front of the player go, the turns red. That's what I was he talking about. It. I'm going to go ahead and shoot it. Shoot the shoot. It hits oh. the rim, but does he grabs the rebound with ease? That was looking good though. Where was the defense? Somebody drum me with the button. button. Tied up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He steps back to create space. Oh, he hijacked oh, that nice shot. Block. What a block. Pass it. Oh, that's not who I want to pass to. I didn't want to pass it to Drummond, but hey, oh, I actually thought he was gonna score. That shot was off the mark. A force oh, what? How's that nice score? Good ball There's the bucket. There's the bucket. Easy. Nice. Yeah, got those. <laughs> Man, lots, lots of rambling around. That's a missed shot. Wow, he just shot it. <laughs> Easy points with no covering up. Tied up. 
Let us cook, man. Let us cook. Nice pick and roll. Oh. Perfect vision. Nice assist. Great teamwork. Nice finish. He steps back to create space. He grabs the rebound with ease. All right, got the ball. Give me a shot. Give me a shot. There's the three, baby. Like Two more points and we win. Three. Keldon Johnson. An easy dunk right there. <laughs> He's ran through everybody. <laughs> wow. Okay. Okay, was that Wiggins? Wiggins? Andrew Wiggins? Wait, is there two Andrew Wiggins? Uh, yeah, we got, we got an Andrew Wiggins, too. <laughs> and that is what? Oh, there it is. Ball game, baby. That is good. See, I, 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 I like the games I put like that. I kind of like that. You know, 11 points. You know, because it's so quick. And then it puts, you know, some pressure, too. Like, you know, makes things interesting in that regard, I think, too. So, yeah, I like that. Yeah, it's kind of like uh, in 2K. In 2K, you get the... Uh, you know, get those limit point games, every you know every so often. So, so I like those. But yeah, yeah. So Cyber Cirrus Cirrus MVP, Andre Drummond for rebounds, to assists, fifty percent field goal percentage. Uh, let's see, I got my three. I got my three. And then the MVP, um, with two, two, and four. And then Matrix Murph with six. And uh, one rebound. And, and a block, too. And, and a block. And I had my three-pointer. So, yep. Yeah, that is that. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Definitely make sure to go and let me know in the comment section below what you think about NBA Infinite. Do you like it? Dislike it? Let me know in the comment section. Also, make sure to go and watch this next video, which focuses on the visual cue settings for NBA 2K24. So, if you are an NBA 2K24 player then you'll definitely want to go and check that video out and i'll talk to you next time peace adios sayonara goes panda oh, out of here Mover of mountains.